Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ellie if you're new here and today I'm gonna to be taking you along as I declutter a couple spots in our home that have gotten a little out of hand and I just need to get rid of some stuff because it's just getting out of hand. So today's video is in collaboration with Rosa Lynn. She has a YouTube channel where she shares all about some really fun DIYs for your home. She is also a mama and expecting her second baby. She is gonna be sharing a video on decluttering throughout her home as well. So definitely be sure to go subscribe to her channel. I'll leave a link in the description box down below as well as her handle to her Instagram account. Go follow her there. Be sure to go watch her video, comment and tell her I sent you. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started with this video. I have a couple spots, like I said, um, one cabinet here in my kitchen is, has kind of like arts and crafts stuff for Noble and like Play-Doh, I guess. Kind of our game cabinet, but it's just full and <laughs> needs to be decluttered. So that's one spot. And then I have another area. It's our closet in our living room, like our coat closet. Um, it's kind of gotten really messy and I don't know if I need to get rid of anything. I just need to go through and organize and declutter that space. And then I'm thinking, if I have time, I'll tackle our laundry room, which is right back there, pantry area, because a couple of the shelves on there are messy-ish. <laughs> so those are kind of three areas I think I'll tackle today. If I don't get to the laundry room, um, then I'll just do that another day. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay guys, this is the cabinet I was telling you about. It's just like on the end. And this is where we keep all of our games, my husband's lunchbox, and Play-Doh, and then like a basket of arts and crafts. So let's go ahead and declutter this and see how we can organize it. We don't have a lot of games, but those are the ones that we do enjoy. Especially when family comes to visit, we love to play games. So I did open up a brown sack that I'm just gonna put in here. I have two actually. I'll probably do one for trash and then one for donations. I'm gonna go through all of this stuff. I have the Play-Doh little container right here that I need to go through and throw away the stuff that's dried. I probably need to buy new Play-Doh. Um, and then these plates that I took out, one of them broke and I used to have a set of four. Now it's a set of three and then one of them's chipped and I, my husband and I really want to get the Corral dishware because my son is the one who broke the other one. So we really need to get something that's more child proof and we don't really want to do plastic. So these I'm probably going to donate just because I haven't been using them and they're not really my favorite anymore. This is more of a 70s style print and that's not really my style right now. So. Those are probably going to be donated. I'm just going to pop those in here. And then we have this egg curtain. We were going to use this for seed starting, but we do have some seed trays, so I'm probably just going to uh, throw this away. Um, and then I had a surround sound speaker that my husband needs to plug back in, so I'm going to just take that out. And then I did have this basket of stuff I need to go through that has like crafts and stuff. And I have a book that needs to go upstairs and then some seeds and stuff. So that's pretty much what's over here. Oh, and then Noble got this for his birthday, but we haven't given it to him yet. He does, he did get one similar to this for Christmas. And so we're just holding on to this um, until we want to get it out. So I'll probably put that in the square rotation for now. Um, so yeah, need to go through all this stuff. And once I'm done, I will show you 
the vinyl reel and what I got rid of and trashed. So let's go ahead and start doing that. Okay guys, here is the final reveal. It's not a crazy difference, but I think it looks actually really good. So I put all of the games up there and then the basket of crafts and stuff I'll show you here in just a second. Um, my husband's lunchbox, cause that's usually where this goes. And then back there is the Play-Doh stuff. So I just had to get rid of a couple things back in there, but for the most part, everything in here looks pretty organized. Okay, so in here, construction paper, and then our DVDs, and then these are Noble's flashcards, and then just some game pieces to a game board. And so that's all that's in there. On the stuff that we got rid of, this first bag uh, is donations, just some random things, a classic tablecloth, um, and some silverware and those plates. So that's what's in there. And then in this one, it's just trash. Okay guys, so we just finished the cabinet in the kitchen. That looks really good. Threw out some stuff. Gonna donate some stuff. And now this is the laundry room. I think I'm gonna work on this now while the kids are napping. Um, this has terrible lighting, just FYI. So I'm gonna try and just get a couple shots of the before and then the process and so on and so forth. But in here, this is the laundry room, the pantry. It's where our trash can is, our deep freezes. So there's a lot in here. Um, so we're gonna go through here, declutter, organize, Make sure it looks just somewhat decent and call it good. Okay, friends. So this is our laundry room and pantry. And then we just have a little half bath over here. Like I said, we keep our trash here. Pantry goods, deep freeze. Car seat usually stays there. This is just some bird seed that I need to put out in our shed that I was working on a craft with. Um, then you turn around over here and this is the laundry room portion. It's not too bad. The lighting is not great. <laughs> We keep our cloth diaper pail here, vacuum, my ring light, and then our broom, which I'm gonna get the ring light out here in a minute to finish filming this. Um, but yeah, this is what's gotten out of hand. I have boxes for my new camera, some boxes from unpackaging things that need to be recycled, some of our canned goods, um, laundry stuff, yeah. So all of this stuff needs to be just organized and decluttered and situated. So that's what we need to work on. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get started and get that done. Okay guys, so I just pulled stuff that was right here and I just have a bunch of books that I've put here because I was gonna donate them um, because I haven't been reading them or I've already read them. So that's what this stuff is. This is getting donated. I bought this for Noble's bed thinking I would use it, but I have not. So I'm gonna donate that. Taylor got this for Christmas. So I need to take that upstairs to Taylor um, and put him in his drawer of stuff. And then this right here is just this is just a box of like brown paper and just packaging and stuff. So I need to put this in our garage because we do um, use this stuff for shipping. 
um, packages and stuff. So that's what this stuff needs to go. This right here is just a basket. Like I said, the lighting in here is not good. <laughs> so I have my little handy dandy ring light. Um, this is my sewing stuff and some craft stuff. And then I just have some fabric right there. So that's what that is. And then these are our um, canned goods that we have. And then over here, I have some candles because our power went out recently and uh, because of the winter. So we have those there for right now and then some OxyClean and laundry soap. So that's what's in here and I think that's what's gonna stay in here. I'll probably move the canned goods back there and then just bring that forward. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with that yet. But yeah, so all this stuff right here. I need to dust off my dryer because it's covered in lint. All this stuff I'm gonna take out and we're gonna donate and throw away, so. Okay, just move those over, move that there. I think I may just tuck these like right in here. It's just a candlestick. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna put those there for now and that'll work. Okay, so that looks really good. Decluttered, organized, super happy about that. Hey guys, so I just finished decluttering the laundry room and then that cabinet. So we did get quite a bit done. This is the closet I was talking about. Um, it's not terrible, but it just needs some work. This is like by our front door. Okay, so this is what we're working with. Shoes on the floor. I have this um, wreath thing that needs to go in my Christmas bin. Hang up the coats and then some wrapping paper, Christmas, a puzzle, just lots of stuff that needs to be organized. So mainly just organizing with this and then I think I should be done with my decluttering. Okay guys, so that's how that looks now. I just swept the floor and pulled everything out, hung up coats. Well, they were pretty much already hung up. Um, put shoes in the shoe cubby and now I have everything laid out right here. There's Mr. Field. He just woke up from his nap. Okay, so this coat is Taylor's old winter coat for his ABUs, but they changed the ABUs, so now this is the one we're gonna be donating because he doesn't wear it anymore. And then these are my winter boots, his basketball shoes, uh, Noble's puzzle, a little backpack. So it, this stuff just needs to be organized uh, back into the closet and probably, I don't really think there's much to get rid of. So I'm just gonna go ahead and organize that and then we'll be done. Okay guys, here's the finished result of the closet. I just reorganized, got rid of two things, and it's back to looking really good. We have some of my boots and the Taylor's basketball shoes, other shoes in the cubby, and then coats. And then we do have a hook right here for some hats, and then just a floor puzzle that Noble got for his birthday, and then his little backpack he takes to church, and then some workout stuff Taylor uses. So. I think that's a win. Everything looks really good. And then here is the donations that are leaving today. Just filled up a sack. So I would say that's a pretty good declutter for the week or the month. And we'll take that to Goodwill. All good. I hope you enjoyed me taking you along as I decluttered a couple of spaces in our home and just kind of reorganized a couple things. I hope it inspired you. Be sure to check out Rosalind's video and go check out her channel and subscribe. Make sure to comment on her video, tell her I sent you. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.